Hello everyone, welcome back or welcome to our channel. We are the Champong family, who moved from the Netherlands to Ghana almost two years ago. We make vlogs about our life in Ghana, trying to change the negative perspective the Western media has placed on Africa and showing the world it's very doable and lovely to live in Ghana. If you haven't watched our previous vlog in this beautiful place, please click here. This is part two. Let's take you along on a day at the beach in Buswa, Western region. Before we begin the video, please help us grow our channel by subscribing and putting Africa on the map. Don't worry, I'll wait. Oh, you're done. Thank you very much. Let's go. Let me see the cash. Cash of the day. Let me see. Catch their face and eat it. Nene, no, give it, not take. Ah. Don't walk on the fishes, please. Put it, put it in the in the bowl. Yeah. Just walk, walk to the bowl. No, no, walk to it. Yes. What's one good. here? Hey, wow. Big one. <laughs> Mama. Oh. Take the bucket. The big one, the big one. You need the big one, the big one. Yes. Big one, eh? Yes. Okay, Micah, come! Operation Rescue! Again, he's yes. surviving. Yes. We're doing our best. Uh, this is it. Let's see if he comes look, back. Look, look, okay. He's okay. Look, he's okay. Yes. He's coming back. Yes. He's coming back. Unfortunately, we have to release him later on. Micah, put some more. 
Very good. Yeah, enough, enough. Not the, not the, we don't need the... It's okay. The sand. The sand. Here, I'm good. Here, I'm good. Here, I'm good. Wow, you're back. Yes. You're back, but sorry, not for long, but you're back. Yes. <laughs> wow. Same thing like in Cape Coast. This is real manual labor. How they drag him in this boat. You see how smart it is, Sophie? So they're using the round things to make the boat go around, uh, slide on it. And then they push it with all that African power. And they sing a song, Yerba, 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 Yerba. See how smart? African power. See, that's our friend from yesterday. Is he? I think so, yeah, that was his name. Micah made a new friend, so he's out with them. We have to look for him. I think I see him. Not sure. I think I see him. So this is Surfer's Paradise in Ghana. It's a girl. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm looking for my car, right? Busua, Surfer's Paradise in Ghana. You guys found my car. So here is the beach. And on that side over there is the hotel we stay. So it's right next to the beach. I guess we just want to enjoy a beach day. Yes. Okay, so I want to ask you, like what's it like growing up at the beach? Do you like it? You can't. I like You like toys. it? You like toys? Oh, okay. Yes. And play football. I, but I'm playing for that. I'm playing toys. Okay, okay. Well, this tour is Iron Mind, but next time I'll come here, I'll bring you some toys, okay? But what's it like growing up at the beach? That's my question. Like, do you swim? No, no. You don't swim every day, but can you swim? Yes. Okay, you need to learn how to swim. It's very important if you live near the beach. So, where's your school? Okay, okay. Can you walk to there? Okay. My tree cry is not that good, otherwise we could have talked. So you could also get your surfing lesson here. As I said, this one is like a surface place in Ghana. Yeah, I'm just chilling here by my friends waiting for Sophie and Micah to bring their own surfboard. They also want to try some surfing. But this is way too big for them, so they have some at the hotel, which I hope they can use.
What? So hi, Where, what, what is your business? What's it called? My business name is Justice Brothers. Justice Brothers. Okay, so you're two brothers learning people how to serve. No, we are not. We actually, we are like six brothers. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. So where did you learn how to serve them? I mean, right here. Yeah. Like I started serving when I was like. Been years. Oh wow. Now I'm 20. Yeah. Years, so, so you really know how to do it. And I think Buswa is known for surfing, right? Yeah. A lot of people come here to surf. Like from what countries? From different different all over the countries. Okay. Okay. And why is it so nice to surf here compared to Accra? Because here yeah, this is the best uh, sport to surf. Like for beginners, for professionals, here is the best. Okay, what do you need to serve? Like big waves like this? Big, like, big waves is good, small waves is also good. Like, and then we have like each wave and each board to serve. Like, you have long board and then short board. Like, the long board is good for this kind of waves, but then the short board is good for the big waves. Okay, I so don't like, know. Like this. Yeah. This, beginner's ball so it's very good for this world okay okay to be honest i've never surfed in my life so this is a new thing so what do people get when they book a surfing lesson do you have accommodation or yes please. oh you have that too yeah. okay that's great that's okay. where my, my brother was talking about ah okay 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 i get it okay thank you very nice to meet you so how can people find you uh on the social platform uh, IG, Justin Brothers, Facebook, Justin Brothers, Trip Advisor, Justin Brothers, and oh yeah, Twitter, Justin Brothers. Okay, yeah. thank you very much. So yeah guys, we are still here. We are back at our spot from yesterday to get some food. Oh, Kevin is only gonna drink water. The kids are still playing and I'm just here resting. Like, I've been so tired playing with them in the sea. And I don't think I should go on vacation anymore when I'm on my period. It's just too much for me. Well, you should definitely relax when you're in pain, but I think this is a good way of relaxing, but just don't put it. It is, but there's so so many videos I would like to shoot, but then I have to go and stand up, go and film this do that. So this will be a simple vlog, guys. Let's pray. Uh, tomorrow is a better day. I enjoy myself. Very good. I think I love to swim a bit. You don't have a uterus that's pinching you all the time, like. Being a woman is hard. It is really hard. Do you want to do you want to should we swap? No, never, never, never. No, not even for a day. No. You know what 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 challenge I'm really waiting for you to do? What? You know there's this challenge where you get the you get the machine that mimics um 
construction uh, construction yes yeah. and i really want to do that with you well, I'll to forget. make to I'll see what, what what it was like to have that for eight hours straight not for eight hours so sophie sophie what how long no no i mean I'm not going to do that thing for eight hours. Well, you have to. No, why? But that's 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 what's my labor. No, no, no. We can do that like five to ten minutes. That's okay. <laughs> what challenge is that? <laughs> that's we a need challenge to do that already. For eight hours. Listen, uh, the way our body is built, right? It's not to endure those things. When, when Wait I go- till I get that. See, this is this is what I miss about content creating in Europe, right? All these things are there for you, like the pranks I will put on him. But it's, yeah, in Ghana, it's just not possible to do that. No, no, so make no, sure you, you, you stay you stay subscribed on our channel for like three more years. When we go back to Europe, I'll, I'll prank this guy each and every day. <laughs> this right. one, you're going to do it for eight hours. I'll, I'll tie you to the bed. You're going to prank me? Yeah, no, the thing, you're going to do oh, it for eight hours. Oh, I'll prank you, definitely. Just know that if you prank me, I'll prank yeah. you three times in this Okay, I'm ready. I'm up for it. Wait, who do you guys think is gonna win pranking challenge? Me or him? Drop it down in the comments. Yeah. Kevin ordered for me a jollof burrito because Aaron liked that so much. And there you have it. <laughs> thing is filled. Yeah. yeah, so it's what? Jollof inside? Jollof chicken, uh, vegetables, avocado. Um, just taste. Whoa, just this taste. is a lot. Uh, I don't want to taste that. No? It's so nice. Mm. And? It is very nice. It's like, it's also salad inside. Yes. So basically, it's, it's jollof with salad. In a burrito. In a burrito, <laughs> yeah. It's really nice. Great concept. Mm. I swear the camera doesn't do justice to how beautiful this place is. Wow, you did very well. How old are you? Wow. See, this is living in Ghana. Enjoying life to the fullest. Wow, great. I am going back to the house. We had so much food with us, so we gave it to the kids, the local kids, they were very happy. The thing is, yeah, kids here might not have the very best education. They might even struggle later in life, you know? But I'm telling you, they have the best childhood ever. I envy them. This is what I want for Sophia Mica. To quick update you guys, I just had a nap. My menstrual pain was just so much I couldn't take it anymore. It was just too painful. I had to go and lay down. Um, so yeah, it's six now. I'm going to tell them that they can wait a little with the food and go and get the kids at the beach. See you later. So I'm back on my commute again to the beach. This time to go and get them. Because we'll be having dinner at the restaurant today. I wanted to taste that. So you know what I feel like? And I don't blame them. But I feel like the way this river smells, it's like this is where the toilets come out. Like, it's a way. I don't, I, don't, I don't even know how to talk. Ghana has a big problem and you can't tell me nothing that oh we're working on it blah blah we have a big club problem environmental friendly is not something that Ghana is there yet at all and we really need that because we have beautiful beautiful places but they are just trashed due to um you know my English word due to pr plastic pollution and then sanitary waste is also a big problem like there's not really a real system for that at all so it's e it's ending up at our oceans which is ending up in our food again so i don't know you see this river which starts 
over there where the underbridge is and comes all the way around here it's ending up in our oceans the same oceans that we use to fish so see how people here are living and then we are just trashing their environment where all the plastic that we have and the plastic brought in as well it wasn't like this before i mean ghana has so many environmental nice things like leaves and all that but now it's just i don't know we're trashing the place hello see this is their town this is where they grew up and i feel like we're polluting it and maybe they are as well because they are not getting any uh, education in how to not trash their environment so it's a real problem because there are banana leaves there's so many options that we can use here but we are not because we're not educating people on the seriousness of the world you're meaning to say that here is way cheaper than Accra, right? Mommy, yeah. you know what this is? What is it, Micah? Oh, but I did it already. They oh, gave really? me soap. Oh, yeah. I just okay. I want wow. it. I want to go to this. Mm -hmm. This one, it, we bought it for you. And oh. this one is just because it's one Ghana city. Wow. Look at oh, the how can it be one Ghana city? Look at the top in the top. Wow, that's very nice. This one is for you. And we bought three for three Ghana city. Wow. But I'm hating plastic Daddy. now, eh? I know, but everything is covered in plastic. So what can I do? The only thing I can and do is make sure that I dispose in a good way. There's no good disposal in, in Ghana mommy, yet. No. I make sure I throw it in the trash. Means that's Any the investor that is ready to come do a recycling, recycling factory in Ghana is going to be very, very rich. So I need you to come, not only about the money, but also come and make the country clean because we need this. We really, really need this. And mommy, the popcorn, one of the popcorn is, is just 50 this? pesos. Wow, that's Wait, nice. And zombie. So we're going to eat now and then after dinner you will, Don't put you will um, get that. Okay. Yeah? It's very nice at the restaurant. Everybody's eating together on the dinner table. Now, ready. Uh, I think everybody's showering and then we eat. So this is a very nice evening meal. Yeah. And this is what mommy is having. We're all eating on one big table with everybody around. Enjoy! We're having dessert. And we're playing Monopoly. Monopoly. Look. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Who, who of you is winning? Who is with me? Me, me. So this is I won't Ghana, say much. I won't I say much. I got Medina, Nima, Accra Central District, and Electrical Company. So anybody having big, big mouth, I'll just do lights off. Madam, <laughs> what listen. Are you, what are you I having? won't. Madame. I won't say much, but listen. Labone, Maybe the cash flow Antobes, is not there yes, yes, at this moment, but Papa gets a lot of good streets. I, like, I have a lot of ground, so you have to pay. Oh, Papa is winning because the lands that he got, Cantonments and Laboni alone. You want to Ox uh, Oxford enjoy Street. Oxford Street, Cantonments, Laboni? You, you pay. You, you get pay. money, but I, I have the power because I'm just going to put lights off. I don't care about lights. So, which ones do you have? <laughs> I have. You have a generator. Wami. In Kruma Circle. Oh, that's also good. I have to D Lori Park. To do Lori Park. I have Liberia Road Senate Bank. Mm -hmm. and oh, I you have, have a bank. A Chimota. But they could have done it in CDs instead CDs. of Monopoly money. No, I don't know. No, but Monopoly money has no current. The little That's boy the is sleeping. Imagine they made it with so. real cities and we just stick it and use it to buy something. <laughs> we could have eh? played this. But this is really nice. I didn't know it was there. So 
Accra Edition Monopoly. You should go check it out. Mm.